Hey y'all, it's your girl Ruby Leah back here with another banger video and you already know what's going on. Okay, okay. So guys, by the title I'm going to be uh, letting you guys watch me install this custom bob wig that I made last year. So y'all, first of all, the wig, this wig that I made is not in the best like construction, like far as me sewing the bundles and stuff down but it was manageable and i believe the lace was a transparent lace and yeah so this was basically a wig that i was trying to revamp it was a natural brown and i decided to do like a um a bleach bath and y'all i don't know if i just did it wrong or what but I wanted the hair to be blonde and then I was gonna dye the hair but I mean it all played out and um, it came out to the color that I wanted it to be so I wasn't like too irritated but at the same time I kind of wanted to get it like that 613 and then I was gonna I was gonna color it but um, yeah so I just started off by washing it. I made sure I conditioned the hair, everything. And um, basically, like I said, I'm trying to bring this wig back. Like, I tried to cut it and everything because when I originally cut it, y'all, it was just a hot mess. Like, as you guys can see, the wig is not, um, like, all the way even. I mean, I did a decent job. I'm not going to say that I did a bad job or anything but the hair was uneven um and it was just the way i installed the hair was wrong um when you're doing a bob you're supposed to put the shorter bundles in the back and the longer ones in the front and i didn't do that so it did come out wrong but like i said in the end i was able to pull it off and make it look the way i wanted it to look um yeah, and I was kind of unsure on what I wanted to do far as styling it. I didn't know if I wanted to do a side part. I didn't know if I wanted to do an up and down. But, I mean, you guys will see at the end what I decide to do. But right here, I'm just going ahead and brushing all my little hair hairs back, like my edges and everything. Y'all, I'm not the best braider, so please don't cover me about my braids. I tried. Um, but I'm just using some edge control. I'll have it linked down below if you guys are interested. It's nothing special. Um, but I'm using that. Um, I had to go in with something a little stronger because I find that this edge control uh, does start to not lay the baby hairs down. So I did use some got to be glued um, spray. And I went in and blow dried it and everything. Then I had to go over it with the Ozzy. Um, Ozzy has like a, I would say it's a copycat of the Got To Be Glued gel. So um, that's what I use. I've been using it for a minute. And as you guys can see, my hair is like basically slicked back. Like I like to put it on to where it looks like I'm bald. So that's what we did. And I'm going to go in with this uh, wig cap. So, y'all, this wig cap was tight, okay? And that's not a bad thing for me because the ones that I usually use are not that tight. So, I wasn't really complaining about it. It was super tight. And I wanted that because, yeah, I'm so used to, like, like looser caps. So, yeah, and I think this cap was given to me by a wig company. I probably was working with or testing out so yeah and then um i just started doing this i started to use the the adhesive glue to lay down my cap instead of just using the got to be glued spray and i find that it works a lot more like easier and it makes my caps last longer like even when i take my wigs off sometimes my caps still be on my head so um, I would recommend if you're like starting to install your wigs to start doing the adhesive first and then doing the got to be glued. Um, so right here, I just went ahead and I'm spraying my wig and the inside of it. I'm spraying the lace with my 
lace tint and i'm also spraying it down with a uh, got to be glued spray that way the tint doesn't really go anywhere i guess i just seen it on a bunch of videos and i seen that it works so i started to do that um yeah now i'm back and i cut the act like the rest of my cap off and i'm just going around my whole entire head spraying it down making sure everything is in place now a lot of people when they do their wigs um they don't know like the right color for their cap now this is me just guessing i got this foundation from walgreens and um i'll have all the information about the foundation on the screen um was just guessing and I feel like this works for me to be honest it really does kind of go with my skin and makes me look like I'm bald so yeah um, I'm not sure what type of brush I was just a random makeup brush I was using and this step is really essential to applying your wigs you need to wipe off all that like spray gel everything after you're done doing your foundation because y'all it's real like a real game changer on whether your wig is going to stick or not because if you have like all that gel all that foundation and everything it don't matter how many layers of adhesive glue you do your wig is not going to stay and even if it does it's not going to stay as long as it needs to stay so make sure you're wipe, wiping your forehead with like some type of alcohol something to get all that spray gel foundation anything off of your forehead or where you're going to be putting your um wig um i don't use what is it called i don't use um popsicle sticks to apply my glue i just use the back of my comb y'all we have to inter Im improvise <laughs> we have to enter <laughs> we have to improvise so i just use that and it works fine for me and now here i'm just um making sure i get this lace melted into that glue like sis we need that seamless look we need it to be looking like scalp okay so that's what i'm doing here but i feel like i've done enough talking so i'm gonna let you guys watch the rest of the video um i hope you guys enjoy it make sure uh you guys comment down below and uh if you guys have any tips on you know wig installing because i do accept um constructive criticism make sure you guys leave it <laughs> leave it down below in the comments so i can check it out but other than that i hope you guys enjoy the video and i will see you guys when i see you peace
try y'all i just been trying to play around with it honestly i don't know oh this is kind of cute i don't know i don't know y'all i really don't know how to feel you know about it maybe i should just wait till tomorrow and see then my edges are staying y'all so that's the end of the video hope you guys enjoyed the video make sure you like subscribe and comment down below and like i say at the end of all of my videos make sure you share the video with your mom your dad your cat your dog because you already know it's your girl baby lee and i'm gonna see you when i see you peace